my channel. My name is Maddie. If you are new here, I am a nursing student and I'm in my first quarter as a nursing student. So I'm currently taking health assessment, pathophysiology, and topics of nursing right now. So I've been posting a few videos of like weeks of my life. So I hope you guys are enjoying them. Take you along of like what I've been doing as a nursing student, how I've been sitting for classes and getting organized and all that stuff. So I thought it would be a good time to do my nursing school supply haul video. There are some things that I don't currently have with me right now. They're either packed away in a box or I haven't ordered them and I really want to get them in the future. So I'll explain them and I'll post a picture in the video of like what they are. First I'm gonna start off with is a planner. A planner is a good way to like write down all your due dates of things that you need to be turning in, assignments, exams, just so you can plan out your life. I feel like nursing school can get a little intense at some times and you, making sure you're all organized is a good way to stay on top of your stuff. So this is my planner right now. I This is an Erin Condren planner. I got this one. My mom got it for me for Christmas and it says some superhero wear scrubs and it has like the stethoscope with the heart and then on the back it's like the same thing. But if you haven't seen my plan with me, I wrote down all of like, I write down all of my stuff and I cross them off with like colors. This is a really nice planner. Honestly, any planner will do. I used to have a Target planner, but I just thought this would be super fun to have for my first year of nursing school. And it will go all the way till um, the end of the year because I got it in January. So get a planner. Next, you wanna make sure you have all of your colorful pens and colorful highlighters. I didn't think I would be the person to have all these colorful pens and markers, but sometimes it's just kind of fun to like write stuff down. So these are all the ones I have. I'll link it down below also, but this came in a two, like a two pack. So I have like two, of like the pink colors. There's 20 pens. So I have 20 total. And these are just like my extra ones and I always keep them scissors if you want scissors too, but I keep them in there and I have this like pen pouch. This I literally got from Target in the makeup section. I don't even think, I think it's for makeup and I'm using it as my pencil pouch. I use this as a CNA and CNA school, but I didn't really write down that much stuff because it was just given to us in a book. So another thing I recommend are highlighters. This is how I highlight like my classes and everything's all organized into these colors. I think these ones are super cool. They're just like pastel colors. I really like pastel colors. I don't really like these basic generic ones. This one did, the orange one did break though, which kind of sucked. But uh, other other than that, all of the other colors have been fine and they work perfect for, perfectly for me. They don't really bleed through the pages that much. So, which is really nice because I don't want to be like highlighting and then all of a sudden on the other page, it, like you can see it. So highlighters and pens are a good thing. I just have the basic pencils. These are probably from Staples, the Papermate ones. I've always had these. I haven't used a pencil though, so because since we're online right now, I write stuff either on my notebook or in my iPad. Another good thing that you should get is a whiteboard. Honestly, this whiteboard helps me so much. I like writing out my stuff like multiple times and like making sure I understand it and like writing out diagrams and drawing them out. So you need a whiteboard and you also need some Expo markers and I have some black ones here too. This just helps a lot for me. I personally like it. Um, you guys can try it out too to see if it works for you. It's literally, it was like six bucks at Target, I think. So it's pretty cheap and these markers were also like six dollars too. Like I said, and if you just watched my past week in the life when I went to Denver, I was writing note cards. So get, your some, get yourself some note cards if you like making flashcards a lot. And I also got this little container so I can organize Organize them all right now I just have them in rubber bands and I just keep them in here and then when I I feel like throughout the like my nursing year I'll probably fill this all up but I like the colorful ones because I can organize them by each section or if you like the white ones you can always highlight a part like this part and color code it that way for you but these ones I got a three pack and they were super cheap too since we are online right now it's really hard to keep staring at the computer screen and when I constantly I'm doing homework online or either editing a video I I always like to have my blue light glasses. So I wear contacts and I have blue light normal glasses. When I take my contacts out, I'll wear those. But if I have my contacts in throughout the day, I like these ones. I like putting them on and wearing them during class. Or I have these black ones. I'm not a huge fan of these black ones. I wish I got the clear ones. I don't know, I feel like they kind of look a little bit funkier. But 
These are my favorite. They're kind of like a cheetah print, but blue light glasses like literally like help your eyes so much. It just prevents headaches, which is really nice because if you're constantly staring at your screen, you will get super tired and these help that. So on to like supplies for being a nurse. I have this cute little case. It holds my stethoscope, my pen lights, my bandage scissors, and I think a little watch I have in here. This is the stethoscope I have. It's a Lipman 3 classic one. It's just the black one. I like the matte black. I'm planning on getting like a little Etsy has like your name tags because I've heard people like steal stethoscopes or like they accidentally pick yours up because you don't have your name on it. So I'm gonna get one of those. I've used this obviously since I'm a health assessment right now, assessing the body. So I've used this a lot. These are the two pen lights I have. I literally just got these off Amazon from my mom. So I, don't, I think this one's like broken, right? It's like very dull, I need to fix that. But and then it has all the pupil sizes right here. So these will be helpful. So these are the bandage scissors. I just got matte black ones. These will, I think, I don't know if I'm gonna use them during nursing school, but I've seen people, other people get them in their supplies hall. But I also have noticed when I was a CNA, I'd be like, oh, do you have scissors? And the nurses would pull out their scissors. So I got these stopwatches for CNA um, like school and during my CNA clinicals, but I used them for that, but the one thing I I always wear in the hospital when I was a CNA and I'm going to when I'm a nurse is my Apple watch and I can always look at either the time if something like pops up and it's an emergency I'll see it on my watch like like a family member text me or something like that I can see that there I have a stopwatch on there if I need to count anything so so an Apple watch is really nice to have on your um, arm wrist right there but yeah because these ones die like i only have had these for like six months and they've already died so but there's my little case where i have everything in so my school actually like sent us like a bag of stuff that we would need and it comes with a i don't want to like take it all out but it comes with a blood pressure cuff a stethoscope a pen light this measuring tape it comes like they just have it in this cute little bag i use the blood pressure cuff and i don't use their stethoscope i just use my own since i have one so that was really nice of them to give us some supplies that we can use throughout the year so for organizing like your binders if you want to do a binder or if you do something else i have either some these are dividers for the binder i just got these like cute ones from target my mom got me so First, I started off with this nice eucalyptus green binder for all my classes. And that was getting like literally overfilled. Like I just felt like it was too thick and I was like flipping through the pages trying to get to each section. And it was just too much. So I ended up buying a new, like a blue binder and putting that somewhere else. But this one is just has, it's cute cause it has like gold. I don't know if you can tell. It's gold in the middle and it has the green. And I just put all my classes. And what I like to do for, what I like to do, I paperclip each section so it will be in my binder and i'll just quickly flip through it and then go to the next chapter of the next section we're, we're learning about so that's how i stay organized i like using my binders because i either print out the lectures or the lectures they were given to us at the beginning so use dividers in the powerpoints in there and then also get yourself a calendar if you don't want a planner make sure you're writing out all your dates i barely use this one anymore because since i barely kind of don't have a desk right now at my parents house it was just i have i used this a lot at the beginning the next thing if you want to splurge on some money i highly recommend a an ipad i do home like lab homework on here so i don't have to buy a notebook i like they have i use the app good notes on here and that will be my notebook i'll write stuff down in there i've actually been using this a lot more than i thought i would i do still take my notes on the lecture and then i'll like redo the lecture and then write everything out on my ipad so i've been using that highly recommend a computer because like since we're online i need a computer i need like a camera so i have an apple mac i'm like imac desktop or i have a desktop and i also have a laptop i want to get a new one since i've had this one for like five years and i was told that they only last four years and this one's kind of getting like beat up like it's not working as much so i may go get a new one before i leave for denver so like if i ever come back home and i want to just bring my laptop i can so i don't have to bring that desktop is like huge you can't really like bring it anywhere but i love that desktop i use it so much i just feel like i'm focused when i'm sitting at my desk and my computer's right there instead of like bringing my laptop and sitting on the couch or something so those are like if you want to splurge a little, a little bit either an ipad make sure you have a computer or a desktop so you can do schoolwork what i don't have right now which i would really like to use or like like to have for clinicals when i start those are nurse iq has these really cool badge like cards 
that go. This is like from my school. We have this one. It's just like the safety of like entering and going into a, entering a room and leaving the room. But Nurse IQ has a bunch of cards on there. A package is like 40 to 40, 50 dollars. I might do that. I'll post a picture right here what I'm talking about. They just have some like tips for when you're in a situation and you need a little tip. It's right on your badge. I also have some badge reels, the little this is like my school one. It's like the circle and to clip onto your scrubs. I have a cheetah one and I also have like a white and black with hearts on it. It's in my car, so I don't really want to go get it right now, but I get those on Etsy and I'll post a link. Um, there's so many on Etsy. It literally just type in badge reel and they come super quick or you can do it on Amazon and get like a huge package of, of like a bunch of colors if you want multiple colors. And for the scrubs that I like wearing, if we get to wear different scrubs is figs. Figs are like my favorite pair of scrub pants and top I tried Cherokee and Grey's Anatomy ones. I like them but I think the figs ones just look better and they are so soft like they it's like butter. It's like Lululemon but of scrubs. So I have a black pair and I have a maroon pair. I feel like in the future when I become a nurse and de depending on like what color I have to wear I'm going to get more. I like the jogger style. They look better on me personally I think so I wear in extra small in top and bottom in those. Get yourself some compression socks. I was just learning about that in class. So get yourself some compression socks. If you're standing for 12 hours or just even for clinicals, I'll be wearing them. I probably need to get a size up. Don't have them with me right now since they're packed away and I'm not in working in the hospital right now or in clinicals. So I will wear them though, but I think I need a bigger size because I think I have too small of a size because my feet were getting swollen, but get yourself some compression socks. They will help. I have a backpack. It's literally an Amazon backpack. I just needed something for when I was a CNA and I've just been using it. It's very like perfect size for me. I don't need this giant bag because I feel like I don't, as of right now, I'm not carrying a bunch of things. I'm at home and I just like it organized. It has the pocket where you can put your laptop and then face to put your binders and it has extra pockets. And then it has a lower pocket right here. So here, let's see, right below here's little pockets, my binders. I I think that's all I have. I will link everything down below if I can find it for you guys in the description. And if I have any other tips, I will link it also down below too, if I forgot any in the video. And if you want to comment your favorite nursing school supply that you have that you think other people would need too, that you recommend. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Please let me know if you like me talking more about nursing or seeing my week in my life or both. So just let me know and I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel channel because see more as much as I can and I will see you in my next video.